Hello, and welcome to the third episode of uh, 20 Minutes. Today is my third consecutive day of quote-unquote of, of clocking in, so to speak. Um, I face a lot of, or experience a lot of internal debate, and often that will result in ideas which I find worth expressing to other people, and like, it's one of those types of things where I feel I should write it down or type it out, whatever, express it before I forget it, and oh, I don't know <laughs> where I was going. Sorry. Uh, and, uh, well, I guess I, w I, I need to try and express those in spoken form. And that's why I'm here. No, I, I'm here because <laughs> I need to keep my um, record going. Or my my streak going of recording these and uploading them because uh, um it's something i want to do and I'll, I'll hold myself to it it's only 20 minutes a day uh so not that bad uh today i've had thoughts that i wanted to talk about like Technology, uh, computers, AI, something like that. I believe I, well, I, I talked about, or tried to talk about how the technology we're creating uh, removes choice, in a way, from humans like as we progress uh it would seem to me gradually hmm, uh less and less choice is being allocated to humans so like we automate uh, we create a machine that will do something and if it, on that <laughs> hmm. I also thought a lot about what I want uh, this podcast to be I don't know what a cop out that phrase I don't know and, uh, of course, I'm examining myself. I accidentally unplugged my headphones, so I'll plug those back in. You should be able to hear me throughout. Anyone who would. My target audience is... I don't even know. And my actual audience is, uh... Zero. <laughs> Basically. But I'll keep at it. And it is good practice, I believe. So here I am uh, to clock in today's time, which is currently a bit after the four minute mark, which leaves me 15 to go. Uh, I find a lot interesting in life in general. I don't. <laughs> Eventually, I'll probably be more calculated about how I address or how I speak in these uh, episodes. I'll keep calling them episodes, podcasts, 
is maybe a better word. And so, like today, you know, I, I spent time thinking about uh, my lisp and I, my voice and tone, the way I sound generally. And I'll work on that. Of course, try to improve it. But, uh,. Hmm. Well, but, but nothing, <laughs> I guess. I lost what I was trying to say there. Yeah, and, yeah. I generally will try to not waste as much time as I do. Though I doubt I'll be able to compete with Tim Tyler in terms of, uh, like mm, thoughts per second or whatever like uh, the bandwidth of uh, ideas he expresses in a video and I refer to him that way because I assume my audience would hear bef uh, previous podcasts which they, they wouldn't always. I don't know. So, technology, we kind of, like, remove our choice, in a way, by creating it. it I think of it kind of like on, on a, a basis of matter, like atoms. So, if you're John living somewhere and you influence your environment and make choices that affect it um, 50 years ago, that, that's a lot different from today. Like, we're creating lasting. Uh, systems and devices that exist and mm, this is where I need to practice and decide like I could create a great presentation for 20 minutes, probably. And I could do it daily. So... That's what I should go for. So, a lot of it will be, you know, self-reflection that I should be doing before recording, and then um, planning out what I'll say during recording. But, uh, I'm far behind schedule, and <laughs> uh, hesitant to want to record more. I don't know, I both want and don't want it. the process of doing work, I guess, is impeding me. I don't know, fear, fear. I'm going to blame fear for a lot of things I guess I don't know it it all seems to be resultant from choices. Not really. Um, people get where they are due to chance a lot of the time. Uh, I like to. I like the 50 50 rule I learned from Hearthstone. 
there's a a 50% and that is that there's a 50% chance for anything to happen and the basis for that law being that it either happens or doesn't <laughs> so there's a 100% chance of something you divide it into two and it either happens or it doesn't <laughs> so in terms of Hearthstone you either get the top deck you need or don't 50-50 chance it doesn't matter that there's uh, like 13 cards in your deck and there's two that would solve the situation you're in and so you'd have a 2 out of 13 chance in actuality of drawing that card but uh, with the Hearthstone rule, or whatever you would call it, it's 50-50. Either you draw the, the two outs that you have, or you don't. <laughs> um, I want to talk about technology and where we're progressing, kind of uh, on like matrix type things I don't know uh, so that, that's where we're going though uh, seeing uh, Elon Musk's uh, Neuralink presentation or demonstration where they brought out pigs and everything that had an, an implant Uh, it quite startled me. Uh, first off, just uh, not quite related to Neuralink. What startles me is the whole mask thing. It is gross that we kind of... Uh, expel moisture but uh something about like the authority and loss of humanity from wearing a mask uh and then like having one king figure not wearing a mask, namely Elon during his presentation, kind of freaks me out. And it's like, it demeans all the other people, I guess. And I'm still caught on my visuals here, but yeah, like the whole wearing a mask thing is rather uh, startling. I think, of course I agree, like it's safer and more hygienic to not intermingle uh, your respiratory residuals. <laughs> like you don't want to swap spit with everyone you see but uh there's something about the masks that don't that concern me from a freedom point of view or perspective Freedom oriented perspective. Like, it, it would seem to me you give up some of your, your freedom and humanity by putting on that, the mask, you know, <laughs> every time. The first thing I do when I walk out of the grocery store is rip off the mask. But, that, that's, I think, more of a, Mm. 
not caught like <clears throat> sorry not claustrophobic thing but uh Oh no, it's just <laughs> they're getting fresh air, uh, something like that. And, and I don't know, that's why I'm here. I can't even express the feeling I have about trying to rip the mask off as I walk out of the store. So obviously, I need practice expressing myself, finding words to speak. Meh. And type them out too. I don't know. Articulating myself. That was the word I was looking for. Articulate. The other, the other podcast. Um, but I got four minutes left. So. Elon Musk had his demonstration. And, and noted that you could still be a happy pig. Happy, normal, healthy pig after removing your Neuralink and <laughs> uh, that seems to me like a nice Freudian slip from him you know referring to anyone who would wear, have a Neuralink implanted as a pig because uh, Elon uh, or uh, our fur is Neuralink company Implanted their Neuralink into pigs to test, and so they're 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 testing on pigs literally. But it would seem that Elon let a Freudian slip go and referred to uh, the the broader general referred to humans <laughs> as met metaphorically as pigs. I don't know. Uh, as, that's like a minor thing. But, uh... Hmm. Yeah, there's a lot of interesting topics I would like to address. <laughs> but, uh... I don't know. I'm like a, a free speech absolutist, so I think people should be allowed to say what whatever they want, and it concerns me how a lot of people are uh, attempting to silence others rather than just not listen to them. Uh, I don't know. I'm a, I'm a big supporter of freedom, and I don't think deplatforming people is promoting freedom. So it concerns me when uh, companies like Google and Facebook remove and people. Like, honestly, I think Alex Jones is a piece of shit, fraudster, but the fact that he got removed from the who, like, a bunch of social media platforms uh, within quick succession within a, a short time frame like they planned it it was coordinated that is <clears throat> very highly concerning to me and uh i don't support it i, I it, it, he's full of shit and spouts ton a, a lot of shit but alex jones should be allowed to speak you know and then people can realize how dumb he is and it it bothers me that people want to silence others. 
don't know. Have a good one.